All right, suppose m is maximal. We want to prove that m to the n must be primary for every single natural number n. So choose a natural number. Since m is maximal, it's prime, because maximal ideals are always prime. And so by one of the previous problems, problem 10.13 to be exact, if you have a prime ideal, then the radical of um, the radical of a prime ideal to the power of n will be that prime ideal that you started with. So, so that's what we get from 10.13. And so now, so this, this radical ideal, this is equal to m, and m is maximal, so this radical ideal r, r of m to the n is maximal. Um, but by the previous problem, if you have a, an ideal such that the radical of the ideal is maximal, then the ideal you started with must be primary. And so therefore, m to the n is primary. This holds for every single natural number n, and so we're done.